English for Arabs is English for all. Presentation Plus is available exclusively with the new fourth edition of Interchange, the most widely used and the most successful English course in the world, incorporating video, audio, and even online resources, all with the click of a mouse. Highlight key concepts. Reveal answers to exercises. Annotate passages. Play class audio passages and video segments. And even embed web links right into your lessons. Ankle. Arm. Arm. Back. Chest, chest, chin, chin, ear, ear, elbow, elbow, eyebrow. Eyebrow, foot, foot, feet, finger, finger, hair. Hair, hand, hand, head, head, hip, 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 knee, knee, leg. Leg, mouth, mouth, neck, neck, nose, nose, shoulder, shoulder, shoulder. Shoulder, stomach, stomach, tooth, tooth, throat, throat, thumb, thumb, toe, toe. Wrist, wrist, cold, cold, cough, cough, fever, fever, sore, 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 the flu. The flu. Antacid. Antacid. Aspirin. Aspirin. Medication. Medication. Cough drops. Cough drops. Cough syrup. 
Cough syrup. Cough syrup. Eye drops. Eye drops. Nasal spray. Allergies. Allergies. Dentist. Dentist. Dry eyes. Dry eyes. Juice. Juice. Pill. Pill. Exactly. Exactly. Later. Later. Awful. Awful. Exhausted. Exhausted. Fantastic. Fine. Fine. Great. Great. Horrible. Horrible. Too bad. Horrible. Too bad. Miserable. Miserable. Very sad. Miserable. Very sad. Sick. Sick. Terrible, terrible, terrific, terrific, tired, tired, breathe, breathe, call, call, exercise, exercise. Exercise. Feel. Feel. Hurt. Hurt. Imagine. 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 Rest. Rest. Take a break. Take a break. Take a look at. Take a look at. Take medicine. Take medicine. Try. Use. Worry. Worry. Bone. Bone. Brain. Brain. Brush. Brush. Floss. Floss. Improve. Improve. Moisturizer. Moisturizer. Muscle. Muscle. Necessary. Necessary. Save. Save. Skin. Skin. Sunscreen. Sunscreen. Exhausted. Homesick. Homesick. Sick. Sick. Tired. Tired. Avenue. CD3. Unit 12. What's the matter? Page 78. Exercise 1. Word power. Parts of the body. 
Part A. Listen and practice. Head. Eyebrow. Eye. Ear. Nose. Hair. Mouth. Tooth. Teeth. Chin. Back. Shoulder. Chest. Stomach. Throat. Neck. Wrist. Arm. Elbow. Thumb. Hand. Finger. Fingers. Hip. Leg. Knee. Ankle. Foot. Feet. Toe. Toes. Bars of the body. This is head. In the head, eyebrow, eyebrow, eye, ear, nose, nose, hair, mouth, mouth, tooth, one tooth, teeth, three, four, five teeth, chin, ch, ch, chin, back. Shoulder, 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 L silent, shoulder. Chest, chest. There are lungs, lungs in the chest. Stomach, stomach. Throat, throat. Neck, neck. Rest. W silent. Rest. Arm. Arm. Elbow. Elbow. This is elbow. Thumb. Be silent. Thumb. Hand. Finger. One finger. Four, five fingers. Hip, 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 leg. This is leg, a leg. Knee, K silent, knee. Ankle, ankle. Foot, one foot, foot. Two, three, feet. Feet plural. A foot, one foot. Feet. Toe. Toe, one. Toe. Toes. So these are fingers. Fingers. Those are toes. Toes. Fingers. B. Pure work. Complete the sentences. I have one, I have two, I have ten. In this exercise, you're going to make a sentence. I have one, I have one head. I have one nose, I have one mouth, I have one. I have two, I have two eyes. What sound? Two eyes, two ears, two elbows. Two, I have two feet. I have two legs. I have two hands. Hands, two hands. Again, I have one. I have one head. I have one nose. I have one mouth. I have one neck. I have one throat. I have one stomach. I have two. I have two hands. I have two arms. 
I have two elbows. I have two wrists. I have two legs. I have two knees. Knees, key silent. I have two feet. I have two ankles. I have two rests. Rests. I have two rests. I have ten. I have ten. One, two, three, four, five. And here five. I have ten toes. Ten toes. I have ten toes. I have ten fingers. I have ten toes, I have ten fingers. Ten fingers, ten toes. Exercise number two. Look at the picture, what do you see? Two young men. One is wearing a cap, a red cap. What's this? Pizza or pizza? Soft drink, soda, soda. This young man is sick, sick. L, maybe he has stomach ache. He's on the sofa. He's sitting on the sofa. He's sitting on the couch. He's very sick. Maybe he has a stomach ache. This young man is carrying pizza. He's wearing white shorts, brown t-shirt, white and brown sneakers. He's wearing white and red socks. Number two, conversation. Lesson. Page 79, exercise two, conversation. I don't feel well. Listen and practice. Hi, Kyle. How's it going? Oh, hi, Steve. Not so well, actually. I don't feel well. What's the matter? Hey, you don't look so good. I have a stomach ache. That's too bad. Do you have the flu? No, I just feel really sick. Well, do you want anything? A glass of soda? No, but thanks anyway. Well, I'm gonna have some pizza. Is that okay? Two. Conversation. I don't feel well. I don't feel well. I am sick. I am ill. Listen and repeat. Hi, Kyle. How's it going? How's it going? How are you? How's it going? How are you? Oh, hi, Steve. Not so well. How's it going? Not so well. Actually, I don't feel well. What's the matter? What's the matter? What's the problem? What's wrong with you? Hey, you don't look so good. I have a stomachache. A stomachache. Pains in the stomach. He has stomach ache, pains in his stomach. That's too bad. Do you have the flu? Do you have cold, the common cold? Do you have the flu? No, I just feel really sick. I just feel ill. Well, do you want anything? A glass of soda? Do you wanna? Do you want? Would you like anything? A glass of soda? A glass of soda? This is soda.
soda, Pepsi, Cola, 7-Up? No, but thanks anyway. Thank you a lot. Well, I'm going to have some pizza. Is that okay? Answer this question. First question. How is Kyle? How is he? Kyle is not so well. Does Kyle feel well? No. No, he doesn't. He doesn't feel well. What's the matter with Kyle? What is the problem with Kyle? He has a stomachache. Does Kyle have the flu? No, he doesn't. But he doesn't feel well. He's, he's sick. He's sick. He's ill. Does Kyle want anything? Does he want a glass of soda? No, he doesn't. Exercise number three, grammar focus. Page 79, exercise three, grammar focus. Have plus noun. Feel plus adjective. What's the matter? What's wrong? I have a headache. I have a backache. I have the flu. How are you? How do you feel? I feel sick. I feel better. I don't feel well. Negative adjectives. Horrible. Awful. Terrible. Miserable. Positive adjectives. Fine. Great. Terrific. Fantastic. Three, grammar focus. Have plus noun. Feel plus adjective. What's the matter? What's the matter? What's wrong? What's the problem? A and B, Ahmed and Muhammad. Ahmed, what's the matter? What's wrong? B, Muhammad, I have a headache. I have a backache. I have the flu. I have headache, backache, the flu, a disease. I have plus a disease. What's the matter? A. A, what's the matter? B, I have plus a disease. A and B. A. How are you? How do you feel? B. I feel sick. I feel better. I don't feel well. I don't feel well. I don't. T silent. I don't feel well. I do not feel well. I don't feel well. A. How are you? B. I feel sick. A. How do you feel? B. I feel better. How are you? I don't feel well. I feel sick. Better. Adjective. How do you feel? I feel horrible. Awful. Terrible. Miserable. Negative adjectives. Negative bad adjectives. Horrible, awful, terrible, miserable. That's too bad. Positive adjectives. Good adjective. Positive. American positive. O as a sum. Positive adjectives. Good adjectives. Fine. How do you feel? 
I feel fine. How do you feel? I feel great. How do you feel? I feel terrific. How do you feel? I feel fantastic. Fine, great, terrific, fantastic. How are you? How do you feel? I feel good adjective. I feel bad adjective. All right, now it's time for today's grammar. And today's grammar is for when you are sick or not feeling well. Now, when we ask the question for the person, we ask generally first, how are you? How are you? Or maybe, how do you feel? How do you feel? And the person expresses their feelings and they say, for example, I feel terrible. Now, we use the verb feel and the adjective to describe the way we feel. I can say I feel terrible if I feel in a negative way or I feel good if I feel in a positive way. But normally when we are sick we say things like this, I feel terrible. Or maybe I don't feel well. So the negative, I don't feel, we use the adjective in a positive way to say I don't feel well, I don't feel in a good way. Or another way is to say, I don't feel so great. Again, we use a positive adjective. I don't feel so great. We can also use the verb be. For example, I am sick. I am sick. So we use the verbs feel or I don't feel or the verb be and the adjective to describe our feelings. Very good. So now we know the person feels terrible and we want to know why. We want to know the specific problem. So we say, what's wrong? What's wrong? Or what's the matter? What's the matter? These questions ask about the specific problem. And to describe the problem, we use the verb have. For example, I have and then the specific problem. I have a headache. Again, the specific problem, what's wrong or what's the matter? And the description, I have a headache. Very good. Okay. Let's look at more adjectives. For example, we have positive adjectives like fine and good. And we also have more positive adjectives like great, terrific, fantastic. So we use these with the verbs feel and also the verb be. For example, I feel fine or I feel great, or I am good, or I'm fantastic. The negative adjectives are things like awful, miserable, horrible, terrible. All of these are negative adjectives when we do not feel good. We also use feel and the verb to be with these adjectives. For example, I feel awful, or I feel horrible, or I'm miserable, or I'm terrible. So these are other adjectives, both positive and negative, to describe how we feel. Very good. Now it's time to practice. Page 79. Exercise 3. 
Part A. Listen and practice. He has a backache. He has an earache. She has a headache. He has a stomachache. He has a toothache. She has a cold. He has a cough. She has a fever. He has the flu. She has dry eyes. He has a sore throat. A. Listen and practice. Listen and repeat. What's the matter with him? He has a backache. Backache pains in the back. What's the matter with him? He has an earache. Earache pains in ears. What's the matter with her? She has a headache. A headache pains in head. Head. What's the matter with him? What's the matter? He has a stomachache. Stomachache pains in stomach. What's the matter? He has a toothache. Toothache pains in teeth. What's the matter? She has a cold. What's wrong? He has a cough. Cough, G-H-F, cough. <coughs> This is cough. What's the matter? She has a fever. Fever, high temperature. High temperature, hot. What's the matter? He has the flu. He has the flu. What's the matter? She has dry eyes. Dry eyes. Eyes? Her eyes are dry. What's wrong? B. Class activity. Imagine you don't feel well today. Imagine that you are not well. You're sick. You're ill. Go around the class, find out what's wrong with your classmates. What is the problem with your classmates? You can use these useful expressions. You can use these sentences. That's good. I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad. I am happy. I'm happy. I'm glad to hear that. I'm happy to hear that. That's too bad. I'm sorry to hear that. That's too bad. I'm sorry to hear that. Conversation A and B. A. How are you today, John? I feel terrible. I have a stomachache. Oh, uh, I'm sorry to hear that. How do you feel? Let's make conversation. How are you today, Ahmed? I have a backache. I'm sorry to hear that. How do you feel? I have a lot of pains in my back. My back hurts me. That's too bad. I'm sorry to hear that. Four. Listening. What's wrong? Where do these people hurt? Guess. Write down the parts of the body. Here in this exercise, we have four persons, four people. They have problems. Everyone has a problem in part of the body. You write here, what is the problem in which part? Jeffrey, what's he doing? He's eating ice cream. Marta. Marta, she, maybe she has pains in head. She's rubbing her eyes. Rub her eyes. Ben.
Ben is about to sleep. He has a headache, maybe. Maybe he has a headache. Allison? Allison is playing, maybe. Maybe she's playing tennis or squash. Tennis. She's holding her arm. This is her elbow. This is the arm, elbow, rest, fingers. So let's listen to the conversation and check the answer. Page 80, exercise 4. Listening. What's wrong? Part B. Listen to the conversations. Check your guesses. 1. Here, have some ice cream, Jeffrey. Oh, I love ice cream, but I can't eat any cold food. Really? Why not? I have a really bad toothache. Oh, I'm sorry. 2. Oh. What's wrong? Oh, it's my eyes. They're really dry. Well, take a break, Marta. Finish your work later. Okay, thanks. Three. I think I'm going to go home early. I don't feel well. What's the matter, Ben? I think I have a cold. I have a headache, and I have a sore throat. Oh, that's too bad. Get better, okay? Four. Ow! Are you okay, Allison? Ugh. Not really. My elbow and wrist feel terrible. Ouch! Do you want to take a break? Good idea. One. What's the matter with Jeffrey? What's the matter with Jeffrey? Jeffrey has a tussock. So. What hurts? Teeth. So Jeffrey, teeth. Because he has a tussock. Number two, Marta. Marta. She's rubbing her eyes. She has dry eyes. Eyes. Marta is a typist. She's typing. She types on the computer. Three. Ben. What is the problem with, with Ben? He has cold. He has a headache. And so through it. Ben. Head. Throat. Head over. Allison. Allison is playing tennis. So what's the matter with her? Allison has a problem in her elbow. This is elbow. Elbow. Her elbow. Exercise number five. Page 80, exercise five. Snapshot. Common medications. Listen and practice. Cough syrup. Cold pills. Antacid. Muscle cream. Cough drops. Eye drops. Aspirin. Nasal spray. Common medications. Common medications. Cough syrup. This syrup for cough. Cough. <laughs> Medicine for cough. Cold pills. Cold pills for cold. Antacid. Antacid.
muscle cream muscle cream cream for muscles for sore muscles pains in muscle sore muscles eye drops eye drops for sore eyes for dry eyes for eyes aspirin a bottle of aspirin aspirin nasal spray nasal spray for nose nasal spray nose cough drops cough drops cool relief for sore throat share videos it's a community we're all doing this together